Hey, what up everyone? I'm Cine Cool, and this is Gems of War. And today we have a new mythic troop, the Turquoise Emperor, for October. So we're going to go do a key opening and make a team of, uh, for this new mythic troop. So first things first, let's go check it out. Go show unowned. Uh, 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 unowned. All right, these are all the troops that I don't own at the moment. This one is the bounty troop. I'll be getting that shortly. Um, as far as a bounty video goes, I don't know if I'm going to make one. Just check out my last bounty video and plug in the leaping spider for the last bounty captain, and it's pretty much the same thing. You don't really need to watch another bounty video. Um, I might put one out. I don't know. But you just plug in the bounty captain in the same spot as the other bounty captain that was from last time. Uh, the Turquoise Emperor, 24, green, yellow, purple, Shin Tang, Divine Elf. Deal, damage to all enemies boosted by blessed allies. Give 3 to 10 mana to all other allies. 50% uh, chance to bless all allies and magic 4 or more gems. Alright, so we got a Divine Elf that's hitting all enemies and, uh, you know, giving some mana. First thought I had was maybe Sikra? Sikra? Uh, because you could give 10 mana back to Seeker, that'd be crazy. Um, you could, uh, make that team a little faster, maybe, by hitting all enemies. But you would lose your turn, so... I don't know, Seeker, you wanna keep your turn. Not sure. Anyway, let's go open some chests. But, we wanna check and see if our guild mates have been getting it. There it is. Just double check, make sure everybody's getting it. And I'm gonna start with, uh, glory keys, because there's gems in there. If you want to just get it as fast as possible, make sure you do Guild Seals on uh, chest level 6. Vanoxia, 11 gems. Nine gems. I don't really have a lot of these, so it's going to go by pretty quickly. And then we'll do, uh, probably just go open Guild Seals. I could use uh, Glory, but it's just, they don't let you open enough at a time. You end up opening like a quarter of the chest you would have. See how it says a, a thousand glory for 50 chests? Instead of like 200 chests, not as fun. I would sit here and do it if I wasn't on video though. Because I would get a lot of gems. But uh, let's go to guild chest. I have 140,000. And uh, let's see how long it takes. We're on the highest chest level. So we got the highest chance you can have. 0.11 The Great McCall Or The Great Mall The Great McCall That was like two things combined I'm super tired right now Captain McCall and The Great Mall Somebody should make that team Sounds like a TV show It's like a buddy cop TV show Great Maul and Captain McCall. They're like cops. They're buddy cops. They also own a bar after hours. I don't know what I'm talking about. Chris Crinkle. There we go. Alright, that wasn't too bad. Um, the Turquoise Emperor. So, I'm gonna make a team. Um, should we just try it with Seeker and see what happens? Or should we just... I mean, he hits all enemies. I don't know. I'll go make a team, and I'll be back with y'all in a second. Okay, y'all. I think I came up with a team. It seems okay so far. I've only used it a couple times. But, uh, yeah. I got uh, Divine Protector, Ishtara, the Turquoise Emperor, and Divine Ishbala. So, going with all Divines that are boosting off of Blessing. So, like, Ishtara is one of the only troops in the game that will... Um, it, cre it deals damage to all enemies. Boost uh, Creates... Yellow gems boosted by blessed allies. So you're hoping to loop with it while hitting all enemies. And, um, you know, you got the Turquoise Emperor. 50% chance to bless all allies and matching four or more gems. Um, and also, if you cast this guy, you have a give three to ten mana to all other allies. Maybe you get up Ishtara if you get out of your loop. Um, Divine Ishbala starting everybody with 40%. Uh, and uh, could also keep your loop going. And then um, Divine Protector is there to get everybody up. Make that red and yellow for each Divine Ally. Everybody's Divine. We're using Priest Class. Double green, yellow, minus brown banner. So let's see how it performs on video for you. 
I don't think it's going to be like the new meta or anything. And the only other idea I had was the Seekra thing. So you would just put this new Mythic on the bottom of a Seekra team. So it'd be like Seekra. Um, maybe you don't use your hero. Let's say you use uh, Seekra, Seekra, King Avrilorn, uh, the Turquoise Emperor, or something like that. It's the only other team I could think of so far. But we, <clears throat> we want to get up the Divine Protector first. So we're looking at green and blue. Got it. Makes a bunch of yellow and red. And then we're going to try to loop on yellow. Didn't get, but we got our Ishtara right back up, which is cool. Bang, bang. 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 Bang, we win. Um, this is a difficulty 12 explorer, so, you know, it's not going to go down easy. But let's show it one more time. That was actually a pretty good battle. <laughs> it worked, worked on video. Might match the green. Cast the Divine Protector. Hopefully get an extra turn. Ishtara. 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 And Ishtara. And Ishtara. See how that looped the entire time? I never lost my turn. Not too bad. I'm sure there's other things out there that go faster than that, but uh, pretty good showing for it. It told a good joke, and it's going to walk away. Uh, like, share, subscribe, consider joining. It helps a lot. Tell your good about the channel. Comment below. Uh, here's the team code. But yeah, let me know. Put teams in the comments. That's always the fun part about these new Mythic videos. You can tell me how many keys did it take you to get the new Mythic. What do you think about the new Mythic? And do you have any teams for the new Mythic? I don't think it's like some new meta or anything that everybody needs to run out and go get. Um, I feel like if you are not getting every single new Mythic right now, it's not something that... Um, it's not hitting super hard. It's not... It's not um, keeping it on its turn or anything. Like, I don't see a reason that you could, like, not just skip it. Um, stealing damage to all enemies, boosted by blessed allies. It doesn't do anything super special. So, if you're being patient and saving until there's something amazing, I don't think this is the amazing thing you've been waiting for. Um, but it's not terrible either. It's kind of like a tourmaline. That's how it feels to me. Like, uh, it hits all enemies, but it's not hitting them super hard. And it's not really doing anything super special. So it kind of feels like a tourmaline type of troop to me. Maybe slightly better. But I'm on, I'm always kind of negative on the new mythics. Uh, and you all know that. I'm not going to say it's super awesome and mega damage and, you know, just to get views. So, you know, it is what it is. Maybe I'm being slightly negative. But to me, right now, it feels like a C plus or like a... Something like that. And so that probably means it's something like a B minus or a B. Uh, so S, A, B. Yeah, somewhere somewhere in the B to C area for me at the moment. Uh, Ishtara was the thing doing all the work here. It wasn't like this thing was the one looping and doing all the damage. It was just on the team. So even if you liked my team there, it was mostly Ishtara uh, that was doing all the work. This thing was just helping to keep us blessed. Uh, which is cool, but, you know, I don't think it's, like, some troop you can't live without. Um, but, yeah, I'll see y'all maybe later for the bounty video. Uh, probably not, though. I made a video yesterday that kind of flew under the radar. Go check that out. If you want to know how to get more shiny keys. Um, and then uh, tomorrow we'll do the spoilers, and Sunday we'll do a live stream at 10 a.m. EST. Uh, hopefully uh, you all got this mythic fairly easily. Um... And I'll see y'all next time. Peace.